Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Team Blue. My name is Elle, I'm from the marketing team at Team Blue. I'm very happy to be back in this video today to introduce to you and instruct you the newest feature that we've just launched, Gen AI Effects. I believe that with this feature, it can take your personalization game to the next level. So let's check it out what it is. Here is my demo campaign. There is an option to upload photo. I have this image of two brothers. Let's upload this image and see how the AI tool can help me transform this image into Simpson style. You can see that there is a small progress bar right here to inform your customers about how the AI is running. Normally, it may take around 30 seconds to one minute to uh, generate the image. So let's wait for the AI to generate. Almost done. Okay, it is done. Very nice. Let's click Save. Uh, as you can see in this demo campaign, I have prepared three different styles. Uh, besides Simpson, I have Van Gogh and Pixar. Actually, you can think of any styles that you want to sell and just ask the tool to have you generate the style. So in this video, I'll instruct you step by step from how to connect with AI tools to design this demo campaign. So you can set up a campaign by yourself after this video. So currently, Team Blue is working with two different services to offer this AI effects. You can choose to work with one of them. Uh, it is OpenAI and Flux Context. So for this demo, I'll choose to work with OpenAI. So the first action that I need to do is to connect uh, OpenAI to Team Blue account. I'll go to my uh, OpenAI account, navigate the API key section, create new secret key, and then um, just type the name of the key, and then um, the key will show up for you to copy. Copy this key, and you go back to Team Blue dashboard. Here is the homepage of Team Blue. You need to navigate the Extras page. In Extra Services, you can see that um, the Gen AI Effects Services section right here, and you can choose Open AI Image and paste the API key that you had copied previously into this section and click Save. So um, that is the API key. There is one important step that you need to um, pay attention and you need to do here is going back to your OpenAI account and see the um, organization section. In the general section, you need to verify organization. So this is the last step that you need to take to um, ensure that the API key is uh, ready to use. So that is for the API connection. The second step is to design. So let's go back to Team Blue. I will go to the artworks page here. This is where you design and set up the personalization. Let's create a new artwork. Name Gen AI Effect. Okay, for the size. All right, so uh, this is the size of a poster. Now I'll add a uh, background layer. Okay, so that is done for the background. And now I will add the image, um, the, the main image uh, I have prepared here, the Simpson style. Uh, one thing that I want to uh, let you know here, in case you don't have this uh, Simpson style image, that you only have like this um, raw image like this, you can restyle this raw image into uh, Simpson style easily with ChatGPT. So I'll go to my ChatGPT account 
and ask the chat GPT to turn my image into Simpson style like this. And then I just download it and put it back to uh, Team Blue account. Okay, so um, that is just one tip for you. Uh, so I'll edit this uh, layer, click on this pencil button. For the option, I'll choose upload photo, option title. The option title, um, upload your photo. You can see it here. And now I want your, my customer to reposition the photo. So I choose photo reposition. Now is the most important part. So pay attention to this. Um, in this image effect right here, you uh, click on add new and search for Gen AI. All right, you can see these um, box right here is where you will put your prompt to ask for the uh, AI tool to generate uh, the image style that you want. Uh, in case you don't know where to start, we have prepared uh, some example prompts for you uh, with uh, different styles like Disney, Simpson, Pixar. So for this layer, I'll choose Simpson style, copy, and then paste the prompt here. And that's it for the prompt. Uh, I'll add a uh, small notes for my customer like, please wait for a few minutes for AI to generate your photo. Okay, and that is done for the um, AI effects layer. And now to um, finalize this, um, this design, I'll add some text like this. Edit it like our in engagement day. Animal personalization. Message change at the farm. Okay. Same thing. Okay, so uh, That's it. Um, and now I'll save and add this uh, design to uh, the campaign and launch it on my store. Okay, so that is for the setup. Uh, before we end this video today, I have some information that I want to share with you. Um, first off, about the pricing. Since Team Blue is working with third party services, so the pricing will be separated from Team Blue pricing. So you need to pay um, for OpenAI or Flux to use this feature. Um, the pricing, uh, I see that the pricing will be paid per image generated. So um, you can go to their website to check out the specific pricing. All right, so that's the pricing. And um, next one, I see that you also uh, concern a lot about the limitation per upload or something like that. Uh, actually, uh, the AI tool already have some limitation on this. And for Team Blue, we also have um, already like um, undergoing some development 
on this limitation. So stay tuned for our update on this uh, limit upload. So if you have any other questions for us about this feature, feel free to send us a message down below in this comment section or send us a message in uh, the live chat in app. We've, we're happy to have you answer all of your questions. Thank you for watching and hope you have great sales with this feature.